Okay, so let me see if I can remember the Chicago thing. Right, there was this girl, her name was Brittany. She had social anxiety, not that there's anything wrong with that, but obviously me and her were not going to hook up. And we ended up splitting ways, and I ended up moving into Chicago because she was actually in Hartford, no, Hanover Park, which is totally not Chicago. I don't know why people say it's Chicago. But uh, I ended up moving into Chicago to the Chinatown Hotel, which was a great, oh, fuck it. Chinatown Hotel, great hotel, that's where I moved into. Other chick, nuts is crazy. Let's keep going. So anyway, got away the hell from her. Then I was in Chicago. I was able to actually enjoy my trip. Trip. I actually had more fun without her than I did. Bleh. Anyway, so I went back to Chicago back in December of 2015. And, uh, fuck, son of a bitch. Okay, so went back to Chicago in December to continue that Watch Dogs Hub Pages thing I'm working on. Ran into this girl named Jessica, worked at a Starbucks. Holy crap, really beautiful. Kind of like a young Mila Jovovich type thing going, but not as weird, I suppose. Not that I don't like Paul W.S. Anderson, but I'm just saying some of his movies... Okay, moving on. Hold on. Anyway, ran into her on the Green Line. Ah, uh, shit, I think it was Chicago Green... Chicago slash Lake Station. Anyway, we made our way back to Roosevelt Station where my hotel was, and she was going to Trader Joe's, and I was like, hey, can I have your number? Oh, shit. Fucking okay, where was I? Anyway, so we struck up a conversation, and uh, long story short, I kind of have an epic crush on the girl, at least until like like a month ago when I went back to Chicago and I couldn't find her. And yeah, fuck it. Yeah, I'm just trying to move on. Anyway, it really sucks that I didn't get a chance to meet up with Jessica the next time I went to Chicago. And I'm bummed out about it, but I guess as a pessimistic prick that I am, I'm just going to get over it, and then it'll be done with it. The only thing I can do. I know someone's involved in this train disappearing. It's a conspiracy, man. Is it? Let me see. It says here it is. It's a fucking conspiracy, man. Oh, it's your high shit. I, I'm not gonna lie to you, everybody. I, this is really blurry. It's getting very. It's, it's already, it was already very blurry before I started playing, but now it's like ultra blurry. And I don't think it's the camera. I hope it's not the camera. I'm not looking through the camera. I'm looking at the screen. It's, everything's blurry. This is why it's important to pay attention because that way you don't see more loading screens and having to go back to other multiple locations. Thank God these loading screens are short, which is very useful. Well, 